Hey, this is Anthony with Revzilla TV, where you can watch Decide and Ride. Welcome to our detailed breakdown of the new Bell Custom 500 helmet, available at Revzilla.com. So what's old is new again. This is the new Custom 500, new for 2014. They've changed a few things, but they're big things. You've seen us do a, pre a few previous versions of this video. The Custom 500, it's accessories. Moving to 2014, the big change is fitment. This helmet now is a low profile design, which is really different compared to any other DOT open face helmets on the market. Now you can see to my left, this is the pre 2014 design I have right here. It's DOT, very similar in its shape. In the center, I have the new version. You can see it's very simple. There's not a lot of external changes other than that they've added a fist snap for a flat shield. So some of the accessories might be different, but again, you're still gonna get a multitude of colors, metallics, graphics, custom artists. They still use it as a canvas because this is the helmet that started it all. But what you are getting from Bell is now a helmet that sits dramatically lower on your head. And they've accomplished this by updating the actual outer shell with a new style of composite fiberglass. They've also updated the EPS, and they're now using five different EPS and shell shapes for six different sizes of helmet. So extra small and small, the only ones that are sharing a shell. So what that's allowed it to do is it literally sits inches lower on the head. You can see it from the front, you could see it from the side. It's going to have the exact same fitment as the latest and greatest shape that we've seen on the RS1, on the new star. It's that new shell shape from Bell, or their new internal fitment shape. So it's gonna fit lower, more snug, and much more contoured to the head, where the original Bell 500, or Custom 500 from last year, is gonna be a little bit more round. Now keep in mind, when you are thinking about fitment too, if you're still concerned, we do ship for free, and I'd love to hear your gut reaction. Click here and subscribe to us at Revzilla TV. But again, the big story here is the fit. If we dive back into the helmet though, if you're new to the Bell Custom 500, remember it is the canvas. Bell started in 1954, Roy Richter. This was the original helmet that everybody is riding right now. Single-handedly the most popular open face helmet we've seen over the last three to four years. Fiberglass composite shell, as I told you, really lightweight. The new version now shaves an, shaves an ounce off, so 2.5 pounds. Five snaps on its outside design, bubble shields, flat shields. You have different visor configurations and options. Depending on the color of the helmet or the graphic, the trim's going to change. So on this helmet, it's rubberized. On this older version, it's chrome, but there are chrome versions of the new Custom 500 for 2014. And you still see the non-removable quilted diamond interior. Now, if you're still in this market and you want to go even further retro, check out the new Bell Bullet helmet, which is a big step up in cost. This bad boy is just over that $100 mark. The new Bell Bullet's going to be dramatically more expensive, but that's a piece of art where this is really a blank canvas that Bell's just done a ton of creative, creative stuff with. Remember, it is going to be DOT in its design. And you see, even when I turn them backwards, this guy feels a little bit more long and narrow, where this guy's a little squattier. And again, that rounded shape allows it to sit lower, but still give you the same amount, if not upgraded, protection here with this EPS outer shell combo. One last thing to call out is that the new 2XL, which is the top of the food chain from a size standpoint on the 2014 and moving on Custom 500, is now a true 64 centimeter, where previously it was a 63 and some folks ran into some issues. So again, the size range has been refined as well. Remember, we love this helmet. Bang for the buck factor, style factor from Bell. Again, the you can't ignore the vintage inspiration that goes into the helmet that started it all. Really, when they used to call these crash helmets back in the motorcycle era, the classic old days of the 1950s, 1960s. Click right here, read other rider reviews at revzilla.com. You don't have to take my word for it. You're going to be able to see what other riders are saying. And honestly, we have tons of different riders and different riding styles on different bikes that are rocking these bad boys in a multitude of different colors with graphics from scratch, rolling sands, and the like. As always, we will ship for free. And if you want to talk to a gear geek about the new Bell Custom 500, see us at revzilla.com or 877-792-9455. Thanks for watching our detailed breakdown of the Bell Custom 500. I'm Anthony. We'll see you next time.